Yo, 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 my Star Citizens and Noob Gamers. Welcome back to another episode of Star Citizen with me, Menix. And in today's episode, we're going to be going through some known bugs and their workarounds for the patch of 3.18.1. Some of these bugs might have been fixed in 3.18.2, but if not, these are the workarounds for if you do encounter any of them. So we hope you like this video, guys. If you do like this video, don't forget to take that punch and tickle that like button for us. It really does help us out, pushing us across in YouTube and, and out to more people and being recognised. We can't thank you enough for the people that have joined and do watch these videos and do give us the feedback and the thumbs up and the comments. Absolutely love it. Also, don't forget to hit that bell and subscribe notification if you are new here for, for more videos as we drop them. Uh, also, check out the description, guys, and in there you'll see the Discord link and other links like for joining the membership of the YouTube and as well as um, other things like affiliate, like 25% off on Emily. Uh, but there's a code in there for that. I use Emily myself and love it, which is a voice command tool. You'll hear me talking to my ships sometimes when you're watching some of the videos. And that's Emily with that. Also, the code dropping down. If you're new to Star Citizen, don't forget to use that code when you create an account with RSI. And uh, that'll give you 5,000 credits when you do create an account and buy the game itself in the end. And also pushes me up in the rankings. I can't thank everybody enough that did the referral last time it's, it's pushed me up in the referral rankings and also has given me uh, the Merlin as well for the referral bonus that we got. So I can't thank you enough for that one, guys. So let's get into this one. So we have the Discord channel and on the Discord channel, Dark Soul suggested doing a video on known issues that we've got at the moment in their workarounds. So that's what we've got. And we put it into everybody on the channel themselves and asked everybody to put in what bug bugs they've got on their solutions so this is what we've got uh, the, the list that got compiled and the list was done by um, Dark Soul, myself, Rickertiel, the Anamare and Seth Ryder so they're the main contributions that have come along on this and uh, so I just want to thank, thank those guys for that so what I'm going to do is the game that's playing in the background is not to do with the issue that's being spoke about. That's just gameplay that I've got and I'm just running in the background. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the categories up. I'm going to put these issues into categories and I'll put the, the words up on the screen so you can read it as I'm going through it. And um, we'll go through this. So don't, don't think the gameplay has anything to do with it. It's not going to be easy to recreate all the bugs and film it and then chop them and splice them and stuff like that into a video it'll just be a lot of work and then you might not even come across the bugs yourself in the end so i'm just going to have the game footage in the back and go through this list so yeah so thanks to those guys on our discord channel uh, we've got about 122 members on there at the moment and, and we're growing that and that's really good i can't thank people enough on there the community that we're growing is absolutely amazing i'm loving going on there playing the games with people when we go on getting a crew together uh, and the organization we've got going so i'm loving it so let's get into this stop boring you with all that spiel and let's get into this so what we're going to do is the first category is food and drink so i'll go through the numbers the issue and the solution so number one the issue cannot put food or drink bottles into your hand from the inventory the solution drag the bottle away from your inventory onto the ground wait for the bottle to appear on the ground then pick it up from there number two issue Unable to drink, even if you're holding the drink, the solution is to put the inv put the bottle back into your inventory and drink it from there. So you can right click on the bottle and choose drink from the menu there. Number three, issue, will not drink a full bottle. And the solution is hold left click after clicking the drink. After you take a sip, uh, keep holding the left click. Once the character screws the lid back on, quickly lift your finger and then left click again. The character will start drinking animation again, but this time it'll drink the full bottle. So that's the end of the food and drink one. So we move on to the next one, which is multi tool and guns. So, number one issue cannot pull out the multi tool in the NAMS system. The solution press I to enter the inventory, drag the multi tool into the inventory and then into your hand from the inventory. Exit the inventory and the multi tool will be in your hand but will not work. Hold R to put the multi-tool away and then hold R or number four to bring it back out and then the, uh, the multi-tool will start to work. Number two, issue. Multi-tool sometimes will not move items or will not even create a beam to move them. Solution. Drop the multi-tool onto the ground and use F to grab the multi-tool. 
and the multi-tool now functions correctly. Make sure to use grab and not equip. If you equip the multi-tool, then it still will not be functional. Number three, issue. Press two to change the primary weapon, pulls out the next weapon, but then puts it away and brings out the previous weapon. Also the same with the multi-tool and the medgun. And the solution is, wait, do not keep spam spamming the button, press it once, the gun will come out, then go back away and the previous one comes out. If you do not touch anything, the character will again put the first gun away and pull the second one out again. So that's the end of the multi-tool multi and guns one. So the next one we're going into is character. So character, so number one issue. Party members become invisible. The solution, unfortunately, is to exit and rejoin, exit the game and rejoin back on the party. Number two issue. The party members' markers, markers are missing. Solution, again, exit and to the menu and rejoin. We haven't found anything better from them them two spawn traps in the wall solution again is going to be to relog out also i found if i push away from the wall when i'm going up or i look away from the wall that i've been that i've been logged that i've been spawning into or getting into when i'm getting out of the bed he, he goes the other side and gets out and doesn't go into the wall so that's uh, number three number four ammo falls off your belt and the solution is, if you put the put it in your inventory first, then pass it to your belt, then it sticks. Number five, issue. Goods terminal freezes. The solution is to step away from the console and reapproach it to wake it up. So there's times where it, it might take a little bit of time for the goods terminal to, to actually wake up. Once you select your ship, you just got to wait for it to, to actually do its thing. Number six, issue. Orison planet missions. Um, players are, uh, or enemies are falling through the floor so the solution to this is don't shoot the enemies or be aware when you are shooting the enemies from your ship that they will fall through it's almost like the force is too much and it ends up pushing the, the body through the floor even though the person's not even though the character's not dead it pushes them through the floor and they go into the planet and then you can't kill them you can't do anything with them then basically they're um, unkillable and you'll end up failing the mission because of it so just be aware of that so that's the end of the character issues we've found. So the next one is ships, ships issues. So number one issue, not being able to set a room. And the solution is you just set a simple route or try to re-manually, uh, or try to manually find a jump point and then um, try again from there. Number two, the issue, navigation bug solution. Selected route does not work and initiates travel towards the sun uh, or random location. Uh, that's the issue so what you have to do with the solution on that one is you have to turn your engines off by pressing U and that will then stop the jump you might still have the jump animation and the jump sounds but you should be able to move your ship and point it to somewhere else and jump to somewhere else and then the moment you jump to somewhere else the um, sound will stop um, issue number four jumping to party members Uh, sorry issue number three um, QT jump will not set a jump point and the solution is to go into your star map and clear your your markers or clear your jump current jump point uh, and once you've done that then this should start showing up again I have it many a times where I jump to an OM marker and then either the rest of the jump points don't show or just the OM markers don't show so I have to go into my star map and clear the route and then even if there's no route there and that seems to sort that out so issue number four, jumping to party members not working. Solution, sometimes the um, chain misses the points like the OM markers and, and um, goes through the planet first, which it doesn't allow. Um, so it tries to send you through the planet, but um, it won't allow you to do that. So what you have to try and do is manually jump to an OM marker or to a space station like Port Olisar before jumping jump to a party member. Issue, uh, number five, issue. Planets on the map, Morbi Glass are not showing and they're invisible. The solution is to turn off your quantum drive uh, or QT jump by holding B and then um, try opening the map again using F2, see if that works. Number six, the issue is stuck in your ship chair even though after holding Y. The solution is to turn, turn off your um, ship um, and then hold Y again. So there's two solutions to this. You can press R, U and uh, Y and cycle through them and then back on and that might and that that sometimes works the other solution i found with that is to press f4 to come out into third person press r to turn your ship off 
press R again to turn your ship back on and then F4 to jump back into your ship again and then that sometimes works for getting out your seat as well. Another um, solution, uh, another issue we have um, with the, the whole uh, ship chair thing is when you when you come into after a QT jump, sometimes your ship might not work. Um, it could just be lag and you just have to wait, but sometimes it might not work and you can see that it's not working and the solution to that is just to get out your seat and then back in it. So issue number seven, can't repair or restock a ship on the pads or station after landing and the solution is to give it some time and try again or try to adjust in your landing and try again. Another solution could be, which we've had, is to let somebody else try if you've got somebody else in your party and we've had that many times where one person can't do it and then somebody else gets in the seat and they can and that, that works so number eight the issue is calling landing services through mobile glass is not working the solution to that is to use the key bind left alt and n and if that doesn't work try rebind rebinding your key for landing services to another key like the equal sign or f3 or something like that and that seems to work for people from there or like um Sometimes I'll just use my mobile glass and say, uh, not my mobile glass, I'll use Emily and, and do a voice command for it. Even though it's still using the, the key bind, it's just I just use the, the um, my, voice, my, my voice for it. So number nine, the issue is the ship spawns in the air. So the solution to that is to store your ship again, press F1 and go to your ship components thing and take out the power component and save that. Then respawn your ship, get in it, turn the engines off and then go and store your ship again, put the power unit back in and then re, um, recall your ship and then that will be fine from there. So number 10 is, I've had this one yesterday, so I was working on a video doing mining for, for part 7 of the new player's guide and I couldn't scan any mining rocks. So the solution um, suggested here is to shoot it with your weapons and that can sometimes wake it up. The other solution I had yesterday is I turned off my mining mode, turned off my um, scanning mode and then turned my mining mode back on and that seemed to work with that one. And number tw um, and number 11 is the cutty black seat kills me and the solution, <laughs> this solution comes from Dark Soul and his solution is um, sell your cutty black and buy a freelancer. <laughs> He's not keen on <laughs> cutties. Uh, well joking aside, um, there is no solution to that. The only solution we had, we found was um, um, CGI are uh, giving people with the Cutty Black an MSR um, loaner ship. If you haven't been given a loaner ship with the Cutty Black, then you might have to get hold of them um, CGI themselves, and they uh, they will they should give you one from there. We had Bakar who had the situation and didn't give him his loaner ship, so he contacted them and they, 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 they assigned him his loaner ship. So that's the end of the ship ones there. So we're coming up to the last one, which is missions. Uh, only two in here. So number one issue, failed bunker mission assessment um, from an area. Now the bunker mission won't show up in your contracts. Um, basically it could fail because the game crashed or you just failed because the people didn't spawn in or whatever, or you end up shooting somebody and it failed. And that takes your ranking rating down and then it doesn't show up again. So the solution to that is to ask somebody else in chat or if you're out with somebody else is to team up with them, get them to share the mission and from there then you can actually complete the mission again then because you've been given it with the, with the share. The last one, issue, uh, number two issue, destroying drugs. So there's a bunker mission where you can destroy, where you have to go and destroy pallets of drugs in a bunker and sometimes you the mission won't won't complete because you haven't destroyed them all or they're not showing and basically what it is is the the drugs haven't spawned in fully so the solution is to don't start destroying any of the drugs until the number actually shows so if it's 600 of 600 if there's 600 um sets of drugs to, to shoot you have to wait till it says 600 of 600 um remaining um or whatever the number it chooses and then once you've done that then you know that they're all spawned in and you can do it then from there so that's the end of the tips from there, guys. Um, if you guys have got any bugs that you've encountered and any tips to or workarounds from that, stick them in the comments so other people can read in the comments as well. And um, we basically just build on getting 
a playable game and having the workarounds from that. I know we shouldn't be having these bugs and they should be getting fixed, but these are the workarounds just in case any of these are destroying your time playing the game and you're getting frustrated with it. Hopefully this helps you out. Even if one of them helps you out, that's brilliant and, and it's worth doing the video. So yeah, so hopefully it does help out. You put yours, yours in the comments if you've got any and what you think of this. And um, yeah, we'll go from there. So yeah, so we hope you like this video, guys. Remember, hit that pointer, uh, take that pointer and tickle that like button for us. It really does help us out pushing us across YouTube uh, with the algorithms. And we absolutely appreciate everybody that's part of this um, channel and the Discord and just putting um, their time in with us. Absolutely love every single one of you guys. So yeah, so take care, guys, and we'll see you guys out in the verse.